Show your book real quick. My book right here. And um, my hands to the streets. And talk a little bit about what's, what's in your, your story there. This is basically about how my dad was down here. I was messing up in school. My mom wanted to show me, have my dad scare me and show me something different. <laughs> he brought me to the projects to his block. <laughs> try to thought it was gonna scare me, and I fell in love with it. And it just backfired, and I ain't never left. And, and you talk about getting shot? Talking about getting shot in this book. Talk about Youth Authority, LP, you know what I mean? Battery packings and all that stuff. All right, let's, let's go back to your shooting. Um, what, what parts of, what internal organs got damaged and hit? I got hit my lung. I got my, I ain't got no gallbladder. I got hit my liver. Shit, I got hit my top of like, my penis kind of like, like shit, my foot and it got grazed like in the head. Okay, and then what did y'all, what were y'all thinking I'm, when, as soon as you got the news that the homie got shot? I'm trying to think, was you out or was y'all in the pen? I was in jail. I think I they was, was in the pen. My dad was in the pen too. Okay. Yeah, everybody was like, it was this kind of time where like a lot of water fronts was in jail. Because <laughs> <laughs> it was a time like that everybody was in jail. Okay, so, so you guys were in the penitentiary? Yeah, it was in the pen. Yeah. Eventually you got the word, right? Yeah. 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 The shit, you know, I knew my mom, when she got the phone call, she like, she knew it was gonna happen one day. And I knew it was gonna happen one day. He used to lace me, they both used to tell me, I used to be on the boulevard in front of the projects. We got across the street, we had an apartment called New Jack City. And that was just like the movie. It was this dope selling and all that shit, getting hit in the motherfucking rotunda and all that shit. So I used to be out there with no dope running away from home. And he used to be like, if you ain't got no dope, go in the back third, go inside the projects. You know what I mean? If you're on the boulevard, you're out here selling dope you gonna get busted on. And then one day I finally got my first bust on, I busted on me. And I was like, okay. And I started, that's when I started knowing it was real around that motherfucker. But hella uh, police chases. Police chase you all day, LAPD, Project Control. Do you feel like you got caught slipping? Was it avoidable or it was just inevitable? Oh, when I got shot? Oh, when you got shot. I got set up at the end of the day. It, it's in the book, but at the end of the day, I got lined up for somebody I used to be from the hood that turned, and then at the time, he was still from the hood. He was like one of the last ones, and then uh, I fell for the okie doke, got in the car with him, and thought we was finna go on a mission on some Harvard cities, and turned down the wrong street, like, hold up, let me get out the car and grab something, and then shit, and then two dudes came out on me, stood over me, and just did that shit, but that was kinda, then he kicked me in, ran, and he, one of them tried to come back, and shoot me again, but it jammed on them, and then they broke. How long was you in the hospital? Like a month. Damn. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't no two weeks, none of that. Lucky my mom had good insurance, sent me to Torrance, a little <laughs> company Mary, got me out of Carson UCLA Medical. Uh, now let me ask you two brothers, um, I wanna ask some penitentiary questions. Uh, what was it like the first time y'all went to prison? Oh, it wasn't nothing to as me. Far I was as what? Dead. You see his neck? I was, I was dead. Dead. <laughs> of, of the experience, what you went through, what it, what it was like, what your expectations, and it was uh, to me. You want to go? My first time out. I was uh, out of the military. You know what I'm saying, fresh out the military, running wild, going crazy. Got caught up, went. It's just another discipline for me. What year was that? Probably in the eighties. Yeah. 80s. Yeah. You probably I a D my, number. I, no, I got an early D number, my first number. Did you go to Soledad? No. Okay. No, I ended up uh, having a nice smooth ride. I got marketable skills. I ended up being a fireman. Jamestown? Yes, sir. <laughs> I was in the Jamestown, too. I ended up being a <laughs> firefighter instructor for inmates. Okay. And did you take those skills when you came home and continue? Oh, I couldn't use them. I'm a career criminal. I couldn't use them. Okay. But I tried. <laughs> So what's next? I'm to the hood. <laughs> <laughs> so block with it.